Hi guys, how's it going? Um, we got a full on day today. We need to finish the rum that we distilled yesterday. We need to finish spicing it up. I won't be showing that on camera because it's uh, it's not my rum. It's a customer's rum, uh, and the customer doesn't want you to know the recipe. So we'll be doing that off camera. We need to drain the steel, and we need to load it up with our black gin and distill that so yeah a full-on day and on top of that we need to make 20 liters of mandarin ready to drink cocktail for a local pub and get it delivered today as well so yeah busy 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 let's get started have left in there after distilling our white rum yesterday sorry after spicing up and redistilling our spiced rum and now we need to clean it up and drain it off use the drain valve let's get it flowing a little Maybe a bit faster. Yeah, good enough. So this has been macerating for the last 10 days, now it's ready for distillation. Thank you. 
get some filtered water, dilute it a bit. Yeah, you can see that Get some water in there. They order a bit more. Turn the heater on. An agitator. Start preheating it.
Okay, we are at 80 degrees. Let's turn the cooling on. Five more degrees and we'll start turning the heating down. And uh, here's my business partner Rufus uh, having lunch. Say hi Rufus. Yeah, we uh, we don't have a microwave or oven, and this is how we reheat our lunch. Ghetto style. Yeah. A hair dryer. Yep. Okay, she's about to boil. Let's turn the heat down. Here she goes.
Very nice.
some double distilled alcohol, you bring it up to 5% ABV alcohol by volume. When you do this, so the army mandarin ready to drink. Easy. Yeah, this thing here. Yeah. Ready. This one. So that's a rum wash uh, that's been brewing for about a week and a half. Now they just tested it. It's done. Uh, I've tested it with um, with the sugar meter. And uh, it's got no sugar left on it, so that means yeast consumed all the sugar. And uh, so it's ready for distilling tomorrow morning. So we're doing the black gin today on the still. That's going to be finished about three or four hours. And when we come in tomorrow morning, we want to start on that rum wash. So before we do that, we need to separate the yeast from the wash and the way we do that is with bentonite clay so um, we're just gonna powder some bentonite clay and mix it with water add it in add it to the wash and uh, mix it all up and by tomorrow morning all the yeast and clay are gonna flock together and sink to the bottom and we're just gonna leave it in the barrel and distill nice clean wash so yeah, let's do that. So we're gonna need 300 grams of meat by the way.
comes in form of those little granules and the easiest thing to powder it and mix it with water just do it in a blender so we're just gonna This is how the, all the CO2 flow escapes. So yeah, that's it. Now we uh, let it settle overnight and we'll just fill it tomorrow. Easy. Okay, so our black gin has been going, been distilling for about 5 hours, just under 5 hours. It's going good, nice and steady flow. We're distilling at about 60 or... What is it? Yeah, we're distilling at about 64, 65 ABV, just what we want level dropped quite a bit we are at 88 celsius and we have a nice and steady flow so yeah we're all good i would say we probably halfway there or a bit less than halfway there we finally done after a nine hours distilling it's finally over let's have a look okay so we're at about 98 degrees celsius and i reckon we're a bit we're like half the volume with what we started it's currently at about eight 8% ABV but the distillate is about 27 to 30 degrees Celsius so that's about that'll be about like what three three maybe four percent ABV and the flow is not steady it's jagged so it's pretty much done the only reason we're distilling it that far is our black gin is full of flavor. It's got 30 botanicals in it. So we want to we wanna get those tails. We want to distill as much as possible out, making it full of flavor. 
All right, but it's done now. Let's uh, let's tune it off. Honestly, this is the best part of the day when you've been distilling for like 19 hours and then you turn off the cooling system and it's nice and quiet. That's that's the best part of the day. Um, I'm actually going to be upgrading the cooling system. As you can see now, right now we have a, a 200 liter drum over there and uh, two car radiators. One is from, I believe, from Mitsubishi GTO. And another one is from Holden. Holden something got them second hand at the pick apart. And uh, over there, over there, we got a, a pump um, which is loud. The fans are loud on the radiator. So I'm going to be changing that to two IBC tanks, uh, those one ton cube tanks. One on top of each other, the hot water is going to be dropped off at the top and the cold water is going to be sucked out from the bottom. Also going to be replacing the pump with, um, with the pumps that they use for heating, um, heating radiators in the house, circulating pump. Those ones are quiet, they're only about 45 to 50 decibels, so yeah, quiet. And uh, still going to install the radiators. Uh, but I'm gonna keep them off and only turn them on if I need them. Alright, so we're done for the day. Uh, I'm gonna go home now. I'm gonna lock up and go home. And you guys have fun. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe. Bye!